you talking to? I, I call you back. All right. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Let's go. That didn't sound like your wife to me. Uh, I'm all right. <laughs> 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 Why don't tell everybody what you yeah. do down in Cuba? Then I'll they're not, they're not <laughs> show them what you do. Huh? Then I'll so, show them what you, you do. Coming up next. I'll let know what you do in Cuba. No way, I got you on camera. <laughs> <laughs> Only on call the voice of But the good thing about it, they never can tell the difference between the two of us. Back on, back on, they don't know the difference. <laughs> 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 no, he's a man of God, boy. I ain't do nothing in Cuba. He's the first man to go to Cuba and don't buy woman. You get it free. He's <laughs> <laughs> a regular. He's a regular. Oh, in the <laughs> name of Jesus. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Lay your hands on you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's called his name a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I was listening to the different ministries that were formed, and I noticed that the FNM basically did almost the same thing that they had criticized the PLP for. What they do? Um, they put the Ministry of Youth and Culture and Education on the one min excuse me on the one ministry. You don't think that's too much for one minister? No, see what people need to understand, right? See this this the other Lincoln, this the educated Lincoln. Mm. What people need to understand is that the role of the minister is to impose policy. They are to, to, to put, the, put the will of the government on to the various ministries. Will there be more than one the, permanent secretary? Hold on. There, will, there are permanent secretaries, directors, with an ass, mm -hmm. deputy directors, and all of these other stuff who manage so they're gonna have the a, different ministries. They're going to have a director or a permanent secretary for culture, one for education, one for youth and sport? They don't need it. They have a whole ministry to deal with it. Dude, what, think about it. What... You culture. That's three, that's three ministries in one language. Culture. What do you need a whole government ministry for? Just to deal with Junkanu and and what go into China to sing and. Well, culture, so you don't need a whole. Junkanu, no, no, that that's what it is now. It could yeah. be more. Well, that's why. All right? me, me and Jelly but, are trying to take that to yeah. the next level. But I mean, hmm. I mean, but my concern was like education. I think education definitely needs mm -hmm. to have its own minister. Mm -hmm. And even though I agree with you that you know technically and. Uh, that's how it's supposed to work, you know, mm -hmm. but in the practical world, mm -hmm. I think definitely education needs its own minister. I agree. Just from a perception of, hey, we serious about education, you know, but, you know, the government just start, uh, let's give uh, the new prime minister his opportunity, and, you know, we'll see how it pans out. I mean, he's experienced, he did it before, he may know something we don't know, but I, I'd like to see education with its own ministry. Yeah, I thought that was the know. biggest, dumbest, stupidest thing I've ever seen in my yeah. life when Perry Christie made, um, what do you name, Alfred Says, the... Uh, the Attorney General and Minister of Education, no, two very important up. things. I think the power move for me would be to make Brent Simnett in charge of immigration. Mm. Think about that. Why? Huh? Go to Spanish Wells. Go to Long Island. So who's the Minister of Immigration? Huh? Uh, I forget. I know who's the Minister, minister I think of make State. Brent, make Brent Simnett in charge of immigration, this immigration Tommy Tell problem. me to in charge of immigration. Wait. The only thing we got to worry about and, is... And Ella is stuff. the Minister of but State. But see yeah. what happened with Shane Gibson, so he ain't going to do that. Yeah, but I think, I think, I think that's you using that as an opportunity to actually smear brand name to say, no. we're taking him back to where no, he's no taking, If he's the Minister of Immigration, no, they're going to no. they, 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 they take that personally. No, well, I mean... No, but going I, around, I, I think he's kicking down good, doors. No, ain't no one kicking down doors. Does, I think he'll do a good job. What do you think? Man, look here. They huh? put the white face to deal with the white foreigners who come in and make the investments. Yeah, but I think that's wrong. I think that's wrong. No, that's wrong. Well, we have white people listen, in this country. Listen, man. Let me it's tell you why. It's not wrong with having that's them there. That's a racist move. Let me tell you why. Mm. If a person come into the Bahamas... He ain't there because he listen, white. Listen. Uh, well, why? He ain't there because why? he can do a good job why? there. Well, who else can do a better job? No, you know what I'm saying? Someone could do a man, better listen, job. He was just chosen at this time. And in a year... No, he was chosen at this time. In a year, he could take someone else and put listen, them there. Listen, Are you saying know. that he put Tommy in charge of immigration because he black? No, immigration no, and, 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 and no, no, no. national I, security? Listen, I talk to people, and people mm -hmm. say they put Brent there because Brent White, the white people mm -hmm. coming in the country, mm -hmm. he could be a better leader. Man, the white it's, people it's, in it's, charge, hold on, hold on, man. The no, white no, people no, back. But hold on. Hold on. F and M is back. Here. Hold on. Look here. Hold on. It's a black it's, country, mm -hmm. and people coming here. Black people live here. Listen. You got to do business with black people. And if you got a problem with that, don't come. You ain't got nothing to do with color. It's all cursing of white. It's all cursing of white. Yes, for the most part. He's not white. 
That's he's why not white. So, so our currency is a Jew. He's yeah. not white. So we don't we don't only deal with white investors. No, but that's not my problem. I'm saying when Brent Simner was put in charge, if you do a survey right now, people gonna say, "Oh, that's a good move," because you know why? He's a businessman. He white. The people coming here, they gonna feel more comfortable with him, and the Bahamas gonna benefit. I think that's wrong from mm -hmm. that perspective. I think you need a person who is tried and proven in business to deal with these foreign investors and their contracts. So All right, you're for saying too no long. Other Bahamian is, is for tried and proven in business. No, no, we're not saying no, no other Bahamian point, can do it. If you have ten people who qualify, you no, gotta pick listen, one. But listen, when you they chose to pick him. Why? I bet you when you look mm -hmm. at the common denominator, you go around and you mm -hmm. ask people why. They can mm -hmm. say, Yeah, he's a businessman, mm -hmm. but you know what? The people coming well, in the country to do business white, they can feel more comfortable with him. Mm -hmm. Hey, you ask anybody, right now my boy get a business, right? And he's do business in the States, right? And he's tell people he named he named Rod. Mm -hmm. But he never tell them he black. They like that. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And that's why these I'm are saying investors, from that perspective. These are investors coming to our country wanting mm -hmm. to do business with us. You why? trying to tell me why are they if a here? black man is there, they're not going to do business with no, us? No, I'm not saying that. I'm saying... Tell you that's ridiculous. No, I'm saying, I'm saying, the perception is, you ask anybody, you have a black business and you wanted to try, put a white guy on. Why? Why? Tell why? Racist. I know racist. I say, I'm a realist. Mm -hmm. Why is I'm the first realist. time? Why is the first time Junior MP made a minister? Miss Dr. Hubert Minnis, Minister of Health. Well, I mean, Why? Well, Dr. Minnis got years of experience. Yeah, but he's a, junior, he's a junior minister. Yeah, but, you know, you got to start from somewhere. Was he, I see that was he chosen because there were no one else in the no, party he was chosen, as qualified as him? He's chosen for his because he's a doctor. Now, did mm -hmm. any other doctors win? So he was chosen because he was a doctor. Yeah. So you don't think Hubert had a reason why he put Brent Simmons to be the Minister of Foreign Affairs? I, I never said he didn't have a reason. I didn't say it wouldn't work. I didn't say it wouldn't work. But I think... Brent would be better served as Minister of Immigration. That's where I want to see, bro. A lot of people saying they don't think Dr. Hubert Minister should have been the Minister of Health, Why? even though he's a doctor. Why? They said it's a conflict of interest. How? He's friendly with a lot of do doctors and a lot of people in health. He's so actually in the business. They said, therefore, he's yeah. in the business. Not yeah, but, yeah, but all the other uh, ministers. So of health, he can make laws knowledge, and policies. Knowledge so. was a doctor. Nobody mm -hmm. complained about that. As far yeah, that as don't I make know, it right because no, they ain't complaining. As far as I know, every other minister of health was a doctor. Why? Why do they but, have to but be a doctor? But why not? I think that's a good move. The same way, hey, Brent is a businessman, and you're putting him in our business to deal with other people coming in the country. Well, you just I think it's a natural should, move. You just thought he shouldn't be there. You no, just said he shouldn't. Say he shouldn't. You don't like white people. No, I didn't say he shouldn't be there. You don't like listen, white people. Listen, you have a I, problem listen, with listen, white people. This show is unbiased. This show is unbiased. We like blacks and whites. Well, if you're unbiased, you got to hear my point correctly. Today's show was brought to you by. Signature Dream Weddings, changing the outlook of weddings forever. Nitro Film Records, breaking sound barriers faster than the eyes can see. Our time is, is limited. Let's get the next next right. topic. Let's move on. Steve McKinney. Well, you want to go for his over? Go ahead. Hey, I think Steve out of order. I mean, I'll, I'll tell you why. Uh, number one, ZNS is a, is, a, is a government station. You know, understand? Now, if he's going to come outward and say, hey, look, I'm a PLP supporter, so this is that type of show, but don't play like you're objective and being biased. You understand what I'm saying? But even more important... So you had no problem with Steve McKinney coming out and saying, I, I support the PLP. Well, I have a problem with it if he's doing it on ZNS, what I'm Why? paying for. Why? Because I'm Why? 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 objective reporting. In the U.S., they have Democratic, yeah, Democrat yeah. and Republican. Yeah, but, yeah, but... I just openly said on the show that I supported the FNM, uh -huh. but I am not biased. I will entertain PLP and FNM yeah, supporters. Yeah. You have a right to say who you support. No, but not on ZNS. You, what you no, mean? no, no, he can say this who he supports. See. But he can't put the spin on it. He have, he have. A, hey, I demonstrated in front of the Tribune because why? I felt Marky wasn't showing. So why you wasn't showing. demonstrating in front of Steve McKinney's uh, ass? Hey, look here. Other people was doing it, but everybody, nobody was noticing Mr. Marky. You know what I mean? But my point is, ZNS is a, is a public station. It's been losing money for years. You understand? The, Mar the Marquis is a, is, a, is a national hero boy. Uh, well, that's your view. I mean, like I said, I encourage the, the 50 <laughs> state to tell the full story. But ZNS is a public station. Tell both sides of the story. Steve McKinney should not have been biased. I mean, a lot of people say, you just look at this little grubby hands that's right there, hanging up, hanging up on you. You just call and you say something for the FNM, hanging up, hanging what kind up. Of hands? <laughs> that's what they told me. What kind of hands? They say, it's little grubby hands. <laughs> <laughs> hey, the only, only thing Steve was missing was his yellow shade, right? That's all he miss, was missing. I mean, see, here we go again. I, like I said, I don't think there's an, anything wrong about that. I am wearing red. I'm wearing red, but I will not be biased. If somebody comes on this show who supports the PLP, I will allow them to speak. And to say exactly who you vote for, Charlie. 
but my point is you ain't here for them. I vote for Bramville McCartney. Why? Uh, I think yeah. you use that as an opportunity. 